Primavera is a European Commission funded project about designing and running new high resolution global climate models and assessing their ability to simulate societally important processes and thereby to support climate risk assessment activities across Europe. Primavera involves multiple partner organisations from across Europe. Several national weather and hydrology institutes are involved, along with universities and research institutes, research councils and others. Primavera aims to develop a new generation of advanced and well-evaluated high-resolution global climate models, capable of simulating and predicting regional climate with unprecedented fidelity, for the benefit of governments, business and society in general. By fidelity, we mean how well the models capture real-world processes. In the hope of enhancing this fidelity, high resolution is a key element of Primavera's climate model simulations. Climate models represent the planet by covering it with a grid made up of boxes. The boxes are typically hundreds of kilometres in size. The models also step forward in time. Because climate models are usually run over multiple decades, data are typically available from the model simulations at best on a daily basis. However, Primavera is different. It will provide data at much smaller timescales, perhaps even hourly in some cases, and with a much finer grid size. For some models, the boxes could be as small as 20 or 30 kilometers. Across the whole globe, this is quite an undertaking. Higher time and spatial resolution is useful for understanding sub-daily and localised variation in societally important parameters like rainfall or temperature. Providing information at higher resolution is not the only rationale of Primavera. In fact, what we want to know is, are these new models better than existing models at representing important processes? The ones that lead to high impact events like floods, droughts and storms, which affect society. If so, it should be possible to use output from these models to add value to the methods we currently use to assess climate risk. Primavera will produce new projections of European climate for the next few decades, out to 2050, based on improved global models and advances in process understanding. The Primavera model simulations will be run from 1950 to 2050. This includes a few past decades so we can see how well the models reproduce the climate of the recent past and a few decades into the future as many users planning and decision making cycles are mostly concerned with the coming few years to decades. Primavera aims to examine the kind of climate processes that impact our everyday lives and livelihoods. A Primavera objective is to engage with targeted end-user groups in key European economic sectors such as transport, energy and insurance to strengthen their competitiveness, growth, resilience and ability. Another Primavera objective is to establish cooperation between science and policy actions and to increase capability to manage climate risks. So if you're an end-user from these or other sectors if you're a policymaker or you work at the science policy interface, we'd like to know what really matters to you. Uniquely, Primavera will use end user and stakeholder feedback from the first part of the project to inform a set of bespoke, very high resolution climate model simulations to be run later in the project. Your input to the project, now and later on, could directly affect how these simulations are put together enabling you to get maximum benefit. There are lots of ways to get involved. You can sign up for user-focused Primavera updates. You can complete the short online survey that we're circulating to users and stakeholders in early 2017. You can take part in a one-to-one -one interview in person or by phone or come to one of the information gathering workshops we'll be organising. 
If you have any questions or otherwise want to communicate with us, please get in touch at primavera underscore inquiries at bsc.es. Thank you very much for watching. 